In this video, I'm going to show you how you can combine Cuzcola to Shell Creator Script and Weed Production Script to create your own custom grow up with a hidden entrance. Of course, you'll need both scripts owned and running on the server for this to work. So to begin, I'm going to type the Shell Creator command and to bring up the menu. And I've already made a shell in advance for this video, so I'm going to select it and hit edit. And as you can see, I've made a shell with the downstairs as well, which I've done just by starting the build on the second floor. At the moment, I have no doorway, um, so I'll just add it right over here and fix the paint on the wall. The main thing that you want to make sure is that you don't build out further towards than where your entrance is going to be. Otherwise, it will clip into the entranceway that it's going to connect to. Okay, so now I've placed a doorway, I need to add a spawn point marker so that the weed script knows where the entrance is. And it's important that you have the marker facing into the shell, not out. So have it like I have right here, facing into the shell. Now I'm finished, so I'm going to hit save and exit. And uh, now I need to pull up the menu again to get the information to add to the weed script config. So I go over here to the add to housing button and I find the KQ weed export type and I can just uh, copy it to clipboard. Okay, so now I'm in my config.growops file located in the weed production resource. I can go ahead and paste what I just copied into my growups table to add a new growup. Okay, so now I need to change the location for where I want the overground entrance to spawn. Okay, so back in game, I'm going to find a location for my new grow up entrance. Okay, so as an example, I want to place an entrance here. And I'm going to get the coordinates of where I'm standing using my own dev command. You can use any tool you want to grab your pet's coordinates and heading. And I'll just type what's in chat and copy those. So now I have the coordinates copied, I'll paste it into my new crop location table. And I'll add the heading here. Also, because I got my PEDS coordinates, I just need to reduce the Z by 1. I can also change the color of the entrance with one of the numbers from up here. So I'll uh, change it to maroon, which is 9. Okay, so uh, now I've set the location, I'll save the config and tap back to the game. Now I just need to restart the script using the save restart command, which is kq underscore weed colon restart and quickly move out of the way so it doesn't spawn on me. Here we go, it's here now. So I can go ahead and open the door and check out our new grow up interior. Oh, so this pot and table and stuff are just default weed props, which will change in a sec. But as you can see, the shell we made in the shell create script is perfectly aligned with our grow entrance. Now, if you want to place a pot inside the shell, uh, we have a command that lets you get the crit offsets. So it's kq underscore weed colon pot offset. And this is a dev command, which will let you see where you want the pot to be placed and when you press E, the offset coordinates and heading will be put in chat for you to note down. So I'll just write these down and copy them. Now in our config, we can change the pot coordinates and heading. And I can add more pots if I want to, but I'll leave that for now. Um, and now we just need to restart the script again. I'll just quickly go no clip so I don't fall through the world while it restarts. Uh, 
Okay, so the pot position is where we want it to be now. I can do the same for placing the tables and the weed presses um, with their own commands. So I'll quickly set them up now. All right, so as you can see, I've set up the props. I can add more through the config by just copy and pasting their table entries and changing the coordinates and heading of each one. I can also change some of the values of the pots to have, for example, the grow tent visible or have the auto watering system on or off. And yeah, you can check out the existing grow up template that comes with the script, which shows pretty well how everything can be set up. So yeah, I hope that covers everything about combining the Cuz Quality Shell Creator and Wii Production script. If you want to find out any more information, please check out our website over at cuzquality.com.